<laughs> it just does not want to stop being possessed. Encoding Overload. I haven't heard that name in quite some time. Okay, wait, wait, wait. We might be fine now. Swoop? That's not their name. That's not... No! That's not their name. They're, they're, their name is Swooper because of the way they, they swoop around. Changing Swooper to Swoop. Absolutely ridiculous, Kanabe. Shy? Oh my. He doesn't say it in this game, though. Yeah, there's a certain sticker. Never mind, there it is. That's the one. Yes. I think I should maybe learn my lesson about spamming through dialogue. Oh, but they just wanted a drink. Never mind. What did I risk my life for? I risked my life for Ultra Spin Smash. It was so worth it. So yeah, normally this quicksand is a uh, instant kill. You know, pretty natural, quicksand bad. But for some reason, this quicksand in particular brings you to a secret room. Okay, you know, that that's fine. It's a, it's a nice little secret room for people that find it. This secret room actually contains one of the scraps we need to beat the world. I'm trying to practice the hammer action command because that. Yoshi Sphinx. It's an actually decent level. It's not the best level or anything. It's a it's World 2 sticker star, but... When you're at rock bottom, there's nowhere to go but up. That is the good thing. We are getting the worst of the worst out of the way. A lot of people say World 3 is the worst world. Uh, they're wrong. It has one good level that instantly makes it the third best world in the game. This one has, like, three mediocre levels, and then literally my least favorite level in a video game. Stay perky. Aha! See, that's actually kind of cool there. I like that. You turn off the lights, and then you can see the light coming from the other room. Oh yeah, doesn't Kirsty have some, like, goofy dialogue here? I feel like I'm being digested by an animal or something. No, she does not have goofy dialogue. L this light bulb right here is literally the ticket to the good part of the game. Because that is, that is the exact item you need to access World 4. Goodness me, Mario, you made it all the way up to the tip of this gun. You impressed me, you really do. Just keep your fake compliments to yourself, you villain. You're here for some no-good scheme, admit it! Good heavens, no good scheme. That sounds so tawdry, tawdry, dobaba dobaba. Oh mercy, this is an exceptional place to do battle, isn't it? I'd say that calls for some added spice, wouldn't it? <laughs> Who could stand in the face of such a mighty array of casual footwear? I dare say I might even lose this time. But he still lets you, uh, you know, spin your wheel. Oh, oh wait, I thought I remembered the sandals doing more. <laughs> I'm just letting Kamek get a move because I respect him. He did one damage. People think the sandal action command is hard. Um... No. Counter argument? No. Seems the things have suddenly gotten interesting. No, they haven't. You know, we got the light bulb now, so we can like, and, and we got the trumpet. We, we could go to World 3 now, or we could even go to World 4. I bought a Prima guidebook literally just because of this level. And the guidebook still didn't help me. <laughs> oh, there's also the jackhammer somewhere. Here, I think it is. I think I remember everything about Sticker Star. If I did, they had to they would have to lock me up. Where like am I like supposed to go? Like, I'm so confused. I confused in Sand Shifter Ruins. See, but the thing is, normally when something annoys me, I remember how much it annoyed me. So I'll remember every single aspect of it, just so I can be more of a hater. Alright, buy Sombrero Bro. Sombrero Guy. Sombrero Bro. They need they, they need to make that in the next Paper Mario game. It's just a Hammer Bro version of Sombrero Guy. I was about to say, did I find an exit? Nope. I, I found a wrong path. Right, I didn't go this way. This way looks kind of familiar. Well, it was familiar. Do I turn this one in the museum? Because I need this one. No, because if I turn it in the museum, then I have to update the overlay. And that's more work than I'm willing to put in right now. Well, there's one path done. I'm going to resort to making assorted animal noises. I have incredible news. Sand shifter. Oh my god. Like that, CC. More like a growl. This is what being in Sand Shifter Ruins for like 10 minutes does to someone. They start 
becoming a furry. CC, remind me to make a remind me to stream the what is your fursona quiz after this uh, bat. Not the animal, the 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 sports object. Isn't there like some silly here where you like you like jump at this bush? I literally did that on my first try. Listen, major props to restoring the oasis back to the way it was. Sorry, that's not toned enough. So I kind of changed my mind in a hurry. Might be a mess inside. It's no biggie though. You should relax. Try apparently making that to that voice more toad just made me sound like a chain smoker. We got the shaved ice, which is what you need to beat the final boss. By the way, this is a cool cutscene though, cause it's like it's it's like wow, what the what the wow, what you woo, you know? Oh my wow! Can you believe such an incredible tower stood here? Something something that big getting ripped out without a doubt. Someone's been using the royal sticker. You got a stone entry. No, that's a door. Isn't this like a funny prank where if you spam the button, you just get stabbed? <laughs> yeah. Ow. I got stabbed twice. I actually really like that the hammer is like area of effect. That should be like a thing in like the T2ID remake. It probably won't be, but like, what the heck are those? They put original characters in my sticker star. That goes against the mandates. How's Mario? How are we gonna prevent Mario from dating men when we keep having Koopas that are humanoid? All right, I'm just gonna assume that any hammer counts. So I'm going to gift the gods with a spin smash. King, why does Luigi look so small? Why is he so small? Shiny shooby shiny slew. <laughs> a shinaroonie. I hit him with a bat. <laughs> he didn't take very much damage. He heals? Oh no, he has, he gives birth. Bro, I have like no stickers. <laughs> I, I think he might be weak to spin smash. Something's telling me he's weak to spin smash. Oh. Doesn't Kirsty say something first? Kirsty isn't useful, you silly goose. Alright, now it's when we hit him with a bat. Yo, Mario Super Sluggers! Yo, I got three excellence in a row. Five. Ah. Get crumpled. Dang it. Okay, he didn't get crumpled from a pal block, but he got crumpled from a jump. Freeze him. I don't even know if freezing is a thing. Eh. What is he doing? I don't know what this attack is. He heals and spawns minions. He's literally the two worst things about boss fight. Power Tower Pokey almost became the next Lava Piranha there. Now it's time for the Mr. Gooms Let's Play we've all wanted. The Fursona quiz. Oh no, you guys can see my bookmarks. Now I'm getting doxxed. Uh, favorite Zootopia? Oh, that Nick Wilde. Don't even need to finish the sentence. Pick a regular persona. Oh, it's one of these. <laughs> or it's just pick it. You know what? I'm gonna skip the tr I'm gonna skip it. I like the picture for Iceland. Black Mamba, you're a snake. Yo! You take pride in your shadiness and people respect your confidence. Honestly, I think we should just end every Sticker Star stream with a uh, BuzzFeed quiz from now on. Um... So yeah, bye. <laughs>